welcome to day classes in the series of video which have been made for class 10 social subject and the textbook which I am going to discuss in this video is history and within the history the chapter of discussion is that the making of a global war and within this chapter we are going to discuss the topic is 3 corn law, why government abolished corn law, major impact of abolished corn law. So let us discuss the first topic corn law actually what happened that due to the industrialization and urbanization the demand of food grain increased in Britain. So in order to handle this demand, their producers or land owners put pressure on the government to impose corn law not to import goods from the food goods or corn from the foreign or abroad or from overseas. So there is no import of food grains, so this is known as corn law. So let us see the point which I have mentioned here. Most important point, these points are being given by CSC board, which I am giving you. Corn law. Upper center expanded in tech industrial group that is understood. Agriculture put a demand in winter, food grace price rose. Pressure from the landed group to restrict the import corn. The pressure from the landed groups put on the import of corn. Government restricted the import of corn. So that's the corn law. So they imposed the corn law and finally restricted the import of corn law. What happened when the import of corn law is? Retail there. So what is that? When the government abolished this corn law, what it is that due to the high rose in price of the food grains, industrialists and businessmen put force on the government to just abolish this one because they cannot handle their workers cannot handle the price of this one. So let us see here. Land and group could not satisfy food grain, those who are producing the food grains. Food price rose, unhappy industries and urban developers forced to abolish the corn law. That is clear. 3 point is all the questions of 3 number. Major impact of abolished corn law, what are the impact of this corn law? Actually what happened there, when the import of corn law started, many countries which were unknown to the world came to be known as the producer of food grains. So let us see that, import of food in Britain was cheaply started there cheaply. British agriculture could not compete with the import. The, produ the production of goods or corn in British was so high in price in comparison with the world. Vast area were left uncultivated because the cultivation was being minimized there and thousands of men and women were thrown out of work so they were flocked in the cities and then migrated overseas. Then finally Eastern Europe, Russia and these all countries were being emerged as a producer of food grains. So I hope you all have understood this topic very easily and I request you all to share and subscribe this video to as people as many as possible.